hi guys welcome back to my channel today is a friday so i'm very excited for the weekend i am going to be doing a weekend vlog um i don't have much that i'll be getting up to but we'll see what comes of this vlog if you're new here please make sure you subscribe and you hit the notification bell so you get updates whenever i post if you're not new thank you for your continued support and the love i truly do appreciate it um yeah i actually just wanted to update you guys because um i am working on something uh for this channel uh that i'll be featuring quite soon um and i had a conversation with a friend uh, who just wanted tips in terms of um like sharing uh your faith uh and being free to speak about it in a work setting uh without of course like being in people's faces or whatever but like when the opportunity presents itself and if the person is open to it just being able to live it out and share it um and she was like yeah uh she wanted to reach out to me because previously when we started uh our jobs uh back in 2015 i shared about my faith and i had this long uh, discussion with someone who was quite senior in the organization uh so she thought that was quite cool i guess um and i was just so encouraged uh, from the conversation that we were having um and i hope that i continue to have that courage to have those conversations um even on my social media um, and engage with those who are interested um but yeah i just thought that was such a i don't know what the word is um a whatever thing uh for her to say to just say keep going like you never know whose life you're impacting um and something that you might be doing which might seem small or just casual um might give someone else the courage uh to step into what they believe is their ministry so yeah that's my friday motivation for you i am still working um it's about two o'clock i'm literally counting down to the end of the day i'm feeling so down this week today especially um not down like i'm sad but the to-do list is ridiculous um there just aren't enough hours in the day and my energy is quite low so i definitely am looking forward to the weekend to just replenish um and relax i think i'm going to be yeah i'm not gonna work late um and i'll be stepping out to go get a few things uh in preparation for the weekend and tomorrow specifically but yeah i'll chat to you soon
hey guys so i just finished work um well i didn't finish i stopped working uh that's what they say and i totally agree um i'm about to head out to the shops um to get a few stuff that i need for the weekend and i will catch up with you guys later hey guys it's about eight o'clock still friday evening i just had a very quick shower i feel like i still look a little bit red very quick hot shower um to wind down for the evening and i was rushing because i'm about to watch um umam kamela's facebook lives like she does this ekamerini series and today she's going to be speaking to single people so i'm very interested to know like what she's going to be speaking about and those of you who know know that i'm obsessed so that is my plan for the evening and then i'll take it from there it'll depend how long the live takes maybe i'll go straight to bed but i'll see i'm not sure but i think it it, it 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 cuts across it cuts across because i want to say to you more than anything else uh the devil uh wants to the, the devil what he wants to do with you as a person he wants to distract you that's that's his aim hey. whether he's doing it through umchado or through in your relationship but his aim is to distract you okay and i can tell you now that um I don't know anything further than that can derail a person, that can distract a person, that can mess up your destiny than to be married to the wrong person. Mm. I want you to know that. I want you to know that because um, I want you to know that because uh, when we are talking about these uh, relationships, when we are talking about Jola wisely, we are not just wasting time. You can't be Jola ring for 10 years with no destination. You understand what I'm saying? So that's what I'm saying. More than anything else, the devil would love to disrupt you and uh, what he will do the best way to disrupt you and to disrupt your destiny. It is when you are married to a wrong person. Okay, guys, I don't know if I told you, but I will be going to church tomorrow, uh, like physically going there. I'm going to wear a mask and social distance and the works. But um, yeah, this thing of doing online church is just not working for me anymore. I don't want to listen to Facebook lives. I don't want to watch sermons on YouTube. Well, I want to do that at my own time, but I need that experience of being in church. Um, I've missed it quite a bit, so I am going to be going to church tomorrow. Very excited. Um, I literally saw a post like uh, just now to say that the church that I want to go to uh, will be open for service tomorrow. So Ndizobendi, there. Um, I was prepping to go to another one, but I'm ditching it because um, I definitely know the experience will be nice at the one I'm going to. So I'm just going to pack my bag. Um, I like to do that like the night before because I don't carry the same bag like I carry when I go for errands. Um, it'll depend on my outfit and just the vibe. I am going to be carrying this huge bag. Um, it still has some of my stuff from before, sunglasses, um, my little notebook, uh my hymn book Christian Momeni when last it nine um I've got some tissues let me take out these things um uh, tissues wipes uh a pen wallet what's in my bag <laughs> I need to get hand cream lip balm i need to get a sanitizer because the one that was in my bag is finished Baby, yeah so yes i'll be doing that i'm carrying this huge bag because i think i'm going to try and vlog um and i don't want to have to keep carrying the camera um so hopefully it's not too much of a hassle but yeah i'm very excited to be going to church Physically, I am quite tired, so I will be sleeping just now. Morning, guys. So uh, today is Saturday. I am 
finalized and getting ready for church i'm ready actually i just need to step out of the door i've got on these eye masks because my sleep has not been great this week so i've got those dark circles under my eyes i'm just going to show you my outfit and then i'll head out okay i've got this long dress from zara with a little belt the lighting's not too great and i'm wearing these sandals my go-to <laughs> i'm sure these sandals have been thankful for lockdown because i literally wear them every week and yeah that is the outfit i feel like I don't know why the dress looks a little bit creased, but I ironed it and I'm not gonna iron it again. It's time to go now. Check this. There's usually cars parked filling the whole street and cars parked inside. That time church has supposed is supposed to have started already. Uh, I see someone going in, so maybe they just haven't opened the gate. But it looks like quite a few people are late. Okay guys, the deacons are not yet here, so I am going to open the gate myself because I don't want to park my car outside. How is that even a thing? Like, Jaini? This is the right church. Putting the blood. Axiano, don't you tell a part of the moon? 
Genesis to Revelation. Uti ben searching bad, uzen kana na lili kunis. Ume ma uti mina lom di lom sila, goba soka tali lili kunis. Kana ma bo matanga ni na kaja ba ne lili kunis. Kona kuno mama hotel, coffee to no coffee. Kunis onzo full. Goba u coffee, bunga zeko onzo shitu call. But u coffee to uzo proof, u to oba na de de pereze. Abakola. If there's one thing more than no coffee, uti laks na ban. Our temple cousin, would, as long as my cousin is here, no in church. And when the cousin disappears, my grandma goes and goes. Would he slim their way? No more corners. And I'm going to say, no more cousin, I'm going to buy. Oh, yeah. I'm going to buy. Yeah. Not even the end of the day. But we couldn't do it. No seven. I'm going to say, wait. Could we shut up? No one leave. Could we ban Sale? Twice his own lead. And then as for that, I can't go to what only bazaar and I am. You go food. It was his only name, and as far as you call us in the house, one good tea. Even me tea. Go back in the way. If we will break, we will call it and go out to the man. He is a silly, see, but that is in the name. He break with you. See, who are you in the master who is a cool way? The very same thing, the vision is now. Hey, you don't seem to need to be exercised. As long as you pray for me, I was so much time in Mazara. This is what I was telling me. But we pray for me, such as. And I was so much time. No, me see, I was so much time. I was so much time. But I was so much time. This is what I was telling me. And I was so much time. I was so much time. I was so much time. Okay guys, I am back in the house of the church. I'm with my friend Uspokazi. I'm just going to show her face. Hi guys. <laughs> Say hi to the peeps. We're Hello just... to the people. <laughs> We're just going to have lunch and chill. Cool. Hi guys, welcome back to this vlog. Uh, I didn't close it off properly yesterday, but I basically just hung out with my friend and then later in the evening I just relaxed in a bubble bath and had a long phone call with my friend Rumbi and that was the evening, so not much there. I don't have much planned for today either, but I just wanted to close off the vlog properly. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna fold some laundry and um, yeah, catch up on some life admin and relax uh, for the rest of the day, not much activity. just checking in i decided to do meal prep instead of life admin uh, i'll catch up with life admin later um yeah durban is super hot that's why i'm shiny <laughs> and looking the way i am not because i don't know what i'm doing in the kitchen uh, but anyway i wanted to show you what i have prepped so far so i prepped this basil pesto pasta with vegan these strips and cherry tomatoes and there's spinach in there um, it's carbs but it's 
the right thing. Um, then I also have stuff lined up for my breakfast smoothies. Um, I ran out of ingredients, so I've just packaged what I do have. And over here, I'm also prepping a green soup. But yeah, I'll only show you if it comes out good. Otherwise, see you later. Pot looks weird because I blended the soup in phases and then I decanted it back into the pot. Now I'm just going to put it in smaller containers so I can wash the pots. So I can make the things that need the pots to be done. <laughs> okay, so there you have it. I've just decanted into smaller containers and then I'll dish from there. I'll also get maybe bread rolls or something uh, to go with that and I'll make a salad to go with that. I will be making other food um, as I finish this. I know it looks very green, but green meals are my favorite kind of meals. I look so sweaty, but yes, I am done. I'm just gonna do the dishes, clean up the kitchen, and then carry on with the rest of the evening. Uh, I prefer to prep, even though it's not nice. I prefer to prep in advance because work can get hectic. The past week for me was insane. I wouldn't even get time to have lunch uh, because I would be in back-to-back -back meetings, no time to prepare, uh, even if something doesn't require that much prep. Um, so I'm just trying to uh, be better prepared on the personal front going into it uh, this week. So hopefully I can conquer. Uh, yeah, check you later. Okay guys, uh, I am done with cleaning up. I am just going to fix something with my curtains. There were people who came over to fix the paint uh, on some of the walls a couple of days ago, but I see that they put it on like quite weirdly. So I'm gonna fix that and then I am done with house things for the day.
Okay guys, that brings us to the end of this vlog. I am doing this wellness challenge at work. Um, I often do the exercises in the evening. Uh, every day there's like a centering thought and an exercise to help you like relax your body and your mind. And then there's an action you commit to or a couple of actions that you commit to to bring yourself to a state of wellness. Um, things that you will actively do to help you get there. It does have some new age vibes, but I quite enjoy it. So I'm gonna do that and then sleep. Thank you so much for watching this vlog. If you did enjoy it, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Thank you.